Hello YouTube and welcome back to another Vacuum Mad 8 video today and today it's our tradition we've got the tree up Christmas day Carl's open a load of stuff but we've has got something vacuum related you normally say big box and um, we has got another big box but it's not vacuum this time so something he's been wanting for a long time actually and one of these popped up a few months back on eBay so I bought it to him a bit early and see what's in the bag or the box um he's been pretty like into these sort of uh central vac style things and stuff so we got a turbo cat ex um obviously we had to try it out um just to make sure it works but it is being used once um, it was brand new when we got it, but we had to try it out, obviously, down to the uh, purchases and stuff. So, this one is a very big power uh, floor head. Um, it is um, suitable for a straight suction machine, like a Henry, or maybe the Bungles Bingles Edition Henry. Um, so... As you know, the Bongos Bengals vacuum has a pretty shocking floor head. Um, so he wanted something with a bit more uh, clout with it. Um, this one, if we open it up now, he'll show you what it's like inside. It's a very big um, floor head. You take a terrible brush, it's probably about half the size of this. This is almost like, I would say, it reminds me of like the old fashioned Hoover Senior the way it um, works on the bottom because it's got a big fan on it there it is there look so you've got two set these bristles are quite soft actually um not particularly stiff there's a fan there and you can't hardly see it but it's there yeah so if you've ever looked at a, a hoover senior you can re it resembles the big fan on the bottom with the belt and if you remember the hoover 700 i think it <laughs> still has from 1926 27 that one is pretty this is pretty much a powered and air driven version of this um style of um system of vacuuming the carpet so it should have a pretty good air movement in it because it's got such a big fan on it so he's been quite intrigued with one of these um he's watched many videos on youtube about this this particular thing um so what we'll do as now, promised we'll show you this um so we got a bag normally we keep the tools in the bag but this time around we bought a grinch one for it because it's quite a quite nice little bag the tools so we've got all the tools in here and then we're going to get this one you going to go get your uh oh yeah we've got this nice yeah yeah with that one that's taking on there so we have got the bongos bingles edition henry um i don't know i mean there must be quite a few of them around now i should imagine but yeah, so this particular floor head in here, well, it's not bad. It skips along the floor more than the other one does. Um, but it's not bad. I mean, it's just it's just evolution of the, the, the factory, you know. Factories have got to... Hopefully, they'll go back to a different design again of floor head. But I should imagine they've got millions of those things. Stand up on its own. Well, it actually looks quite good with it. Yeah, so it is Christmas morning, uh, mind you, and when we're doing this video. What's the power release? So it's got a power release on it. So you pull it out like that. They get shared. He, he's poles well together, don't they, mate? <laughs> <laughs> it should come out. Yeah. So, yeah, so this one is fully compatible with a pneumatic. Is it better than the, um, the ones you get from my Henry? Well, probably. <laughs> maybe, maybe not, but... It is a different sort of system. Um, it's got plastic fan on it, isn't it? Mind yeah. you. 
So if you're going to suck up nails and stuff like that, well... It even stands up with a Henry on it. So <laughs> it's pretty much stood up on its own here. Like, oh, hold that one. You don't take him to damage the tree. Oh, the balls on the tree, I bought from like, I think I paid £35 for all the decorations on the tree. I think minus about five decorations, which I had hanging around the house. So I budgeted, got a nice tree for what I spent on it. You don't need the really expensive ones. Um, no, wait, there's a tree there that we plug in it in. I mean, they were like £5 for four. I think they were separate, but yeah, £35 all in. I think for even these little soldiers and the swirls and a bit of a candy cane theme for this year's tree. So yeah, we got the, uh, so this one is a bit of a beast in it, mate, really. Shame you didn't have a real one, really. I'll see how well that would get on with the uh, fine, fine needles and stuff. So as you know, that one there is working quite well, actually. Um, but this one's compatible with most machines, isn't it? Anything with a 32 mil pole on it. Um, so you can use it on... You can use this one on... So it's scored a terrible cat. Um, these four heads have been around for a very long time, haven't they? But in the UK, um, they were mainly... I don't know where this particular person got them from, but they're generally like a central vac attachment. I think it is from a central vac shop. But they've just generally had the same... They've generally had the same thing, but with different tops on them. But it is generally the same design. Um, I think the floor heads are different. Did they have one with beaters on it? Years ago, the uh, the first Turbo Cat was called the Rug. It's called the Rug Cat, the original one. Right. And that had a beater bar on it, and it had the turbine. Instead of having the turbine in there, it had it make bare. Oh yeah. Stick at the top of it. So this this particular company has been around. So I think this one was more a lot. They also make a mini one called the Rug Rat. I think this one we got for for, for about half the price of what it should be really. Um, you're looking at about maybe under a quid for one of these, but I think we paid probably, I, I, I think it was about just under. Yeah, so I think, you know, you could get yourself the Henry attachment one, but I don't really know what the newer ones are like, because if, if it's anything like the floor head, um, I don't know. But this one is a, a different version of it, really. And it is, he's always wanted one with like a, the Hoover Senior style, but bottom on it, you know. Um, so, yeah, so thanks for watching. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. I'll see you again in 2023 with some more videos. Uh, videos will be less sparse, but, you know, we could just keep the tradition going, having a Christmas Day unboxing. Nothing too, like, like you say, this one can run many machines out there. There's many machines you can use them with. Honestly, I want to get a twin motor for a huge it off. Yeah, he would. He did want to get the twin motor pneumatic, but I think, all oh right, it had two motors in it, but it was more than three or four times the price of a single motor, Henry. <laughs> so, so and it and it were massive as well. And it I said, now nah, just just get that. But yeah, you know, just suck that up quickly, I want mate. Also, more powerful motor because I want to get this back to the same speed as central back. <laughs> Well, we have got more powerful. I think a Jules might get it up to that speed. <laughs> got plenty of 1200 ones, haven't you? It is a beast, isn't it? 
Just let me be able to on that one. So there we are going again, a little bit more. So thanks for watching and uh, bye for now. And Merry Christmas.